Synity, your digital cinema tech resource, supported by B and H and CVP. Hello, everyone. My name is Graham Ayler Sheldon, and I'm a Roscoe and Sigma ambassador and filmmaker. And this is the Cinematography Challenge, sponsored by Roscoe and Sigma. We're here in LA to essentially nerd out about cinematography with a heavy emphasis on color, lighting, and optics. Today, I'm joined by DP Senda Bonet. And Senda, thank you so much for being here. Tell us just a little bit about your background. How'd you get started in cinematography? I was in a family of filmmakers. So I started with my grandpa, my mom uh, was a director, uh, and my stepdad was a DP. And so at an early age, I was in front of the camera. So, you know, doing commercials for shampoo or that kind of stuff. But uh, I was really impressed by the camera, the lighting, um, and seeing my stepdad work. And so, uh, yeah, I think it just continued in my brain for a little bit. And then, yeah, I was, uh, wanted to do that. And, my life. and what kind of projects do you work on now? Do you have like a bread and butter kind of genre you stick to or? Uh, I, oh, no, no, not necessarily genre, but uh, I'm doing feature films, uh, mostly, yeah, narrative. Uh, right now I'm prepping a film, uh, a comedy, shooting very soon, actually. Uh, okay, so we have a couple of quick rules that we're gonna get out of the way here. Mm -hmm. We select one theme, movie type, or film, and here's just a few of the options. Beyond that, we've added a little twist in the form of color. So you're gonna have to incorporate a color, doesn't matter how you're using it, but just keep, keep that in mind. That's open to interpretation. Um, from there, you have 30 minutes to light a single sequence using any Sigma Cine Prime lens and primarily Roscoe DMG Lumiere lights available to you. So why 30 minutes? It, it doesn't matter the size of the project. I'm sure you've had that moment where it's like you're under the pressure, you have to go, you're losing light, the talent's leaving, whatever it is. So, you know, fear not, I'm gonna be here to help with the setup as well as the team from Sigma and Roscoe. So that's it, does that sound okay? Great, okay. yep. Okay. <laughs> um, we hope this series will be fun, hopefully a bit educational because the best way to improve is to test and try new things. Okay, so here we go. Go ahead, maybe I'll you know, mix it up and uh, right. pick your pick your topic. All right, what'd you get? Oh, Dario Argento. Okay, tell us about do you. So, what do you know about Dario Argento? Are you familiar with him as a director? Yeah, of course, I love his films. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seventies, yeah, so. you know, horror films, a lot of colors. So that's really cool for you know our subject. A yeah. lot of blue and red, a lot. Probably his colors, sometimes a little bit of green, but yeah. It's great. Okay, so we're gonna go outside. You have access to basically the whole Sigma Prime lineup out there. You have a bunch of lighting options from Roscoe. You have a few different types of filters if you wanna do that too. So let's go outside, let's uh, let's pick some gear. All right. All right, here we go. Okay, Cinda, so you have a variety of different focal lengths here, everything from 14 millimeter to 135. And then uh, you have a few different focal lengths here of the Sigma Classics as well. Really kind of fun, vintagey feeling characteristics, lots of flares, low contrast, still honestly reasonably sharp as well. So, and then we also have a uh, DMG Dash quad kit right here. There's a DMG Lumia Roscoe uh, Mini here as well. You also have the SL1 that we've already kind of staged inside for you. You have a few of those. You also have the Maxi too for just lots of, lots of light. Great, right. yeah. What are you thinking, uh, which uh, focal length do you want to go with? So I think uh, we're going to go with, yeah, the classic. I okay. think to go back, you know, to like the film look, 70s, it was not really sharp. So I think, yeah, we're going to start with that. Okay. And I want to try with the 50. So yeah. Sounds good. Well, your 30 minutes are going to start pretty much right now. Are you ready? Okay, let's do it. So Ro Roscoe, friends, can I get three dashes on standby with the magnet mount? Copy. Yeah, um, and then I would like to do... Uh, a push in on someone. Okay, we, we have it. Is it Dana Dolly okay? We have a Dana Dolly. Dana Dolly is great. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and let's say that you are on your computer um, looking at something that really upsets you, and then you hear a noise through that door. And so you go, you stand up, and you're gonna go grab something in uh, one of these drawers. Okay. Uh, probably a knife, something, I don't know, a sharp thing. Yeah, yeah. And then, um, and then you're going to open the door slowly and okay. uh, 
probably get it. We'll see. Okay, okay so so uh, let's get him a chair of some kind just to, to chill out there. So we're going to need a Dana Dolly right here. Yeah. And then a uh, Humphrey Poe camera. This is a fun chair right here. We go. Oh, right here, right here. We're going to be oh, you're uh, right. back back to in us. his back, yeah. Got it. With the computer? I'm already feeling the uh, Dari Argento vibes. <laughs> that's, yeah, <laughs> right? that's cool. cool, cool. <laughs> um, so we have those three dashes. So, uh, Mac and Mouse. Uh, yeah, let's do some modifiers on it. So we have gr little grids too for these. Grids, domes, and the dot. So grids, let's do the grids with okay. uh, a so little diffusion. These are the grids that Cinda's talking about right here, just narrowing that beam angle. Yeah. A little and diffusion. A little diffusion. So we have, yeah, this one, we can stack them, right? Yep. Yeah, great. Okay, so a little diffusion, grid on top, magnet mounts. You want to try that out? Great. Cool, okay. Amazing. So we're going to uh, light the background. It's really for the background. Oh, it's for the background. Yeah. Okay, can I have a full apple, please? I think I'm tall enough for this. And so the Dana Dolly is going to be right okay. here. Ready? It's going to be a push in on Let's him. Let's see if we get the Sorry, I blocked you in. Yeah. Yeah. Apologies. Uh, it's a little crowded. So, Senda, we also have some cine foil with us too. If you want to keep this off our subject and stay on background, we, we got... will. Yeah, and probably from that white wall, so we don't have. Oh, from the white wall, okay. Yeah, any perfect more for the background. Um, great. Start staging. Yes, uh, I would love also some backlight on our subject. So probably light on the top because we're we cannot have a system here if yeah. you're standing up and we're panning. So if we can uh, attach something on top. Yeah, I think uh, we're okay mounting mini. to these ceilings. I think this is yeah. this is this will work. Uh, yeah. Okay, so maybe like a mini. A mini would be perfect. Yeah. Uh, okay. We're gonna need to match the color as well from uh, our pictures. So in these the back. three will match that mini. Yeah. Uh, okay, perfect. Okay, so if Alex, if you can get a mini mounted to the ceiling safely, you know we always want to think about safety. We'll get that up there, and then these are going. Let me see if this. All right. Magnet mount. Oh, that's great. Wow. That's exactly the right thing to do. Perfect. All right, so we have other quarter 20 mounting points. We're going to use a different one, solving a problem that I created myself. OK. And Zach, see if you can have hand on camera. Tell, uh, let us know the height. Yeah. All right, and ring ring going up. And stop. Oh. OK. Cool. cool. Oh yeah, they're very, I can see already, they're very creamy. Yeah. yeah. All right. They're nice. Very late 70s already. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay, and what color temp would you like those dashes at back there? So, let's, can we start maybe taking the reference that you gave me, Dario Argento, so mm -hmm. if we can maybe find an image from Suspiria, for example, and yeah. we're going to try to match the color uh, with the app, that would be fun to try. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going with the blue. So I would like to have blue inside here, and then when he's going to open the door, we're going to need another fixture with some deep red. Okay. What what sort of fixture? Maybe an SL1? I think we'll do an SL1. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So I am live Googling Suspiria color. Okay. Great. And I have an image. So I'm going to send this to the Roscoe team. They're going to help me out pick that image. So we have some overhead practicals playing. Cool. Senda, do you want to kill those at this point? Or yes, let's kill those. Senda, we're, yes. so we have the mini safely in the ceiling. Uh, cool. where, where would awesome. you like that? Amazing. Oriented? So this is so this is the color that we choose uh, from uh, the photo. Uh, but I feel like it's super pink. Uh, so uh, we're going to try to go more towards the uh, uh, red. Red, OK. More the red side. Of, uh, we can kind of eyeball that in. Um, I feel like we have we have a lot of light coming from this little. We have a little light. Oh, right of, is yeah. the intensity the same on all those units? It is. Okay. What 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 is the intensity? We're at 100. A hundred. Yeah, we can take the diffusion. I think we'll take. I think actually we'll take the grid off. Uh, yeah. All three of them. All three of them. Okay, yeah. I can do that right yeah. now. Lenses okay, so we are at a T2.5 currently. 2.5, okay. Yeah. Oh, let's see that. Uh, and what is our... Um, 800 ISO. 800 ISO, okay. Mm -hmm. okay and, and we're living at 5600 Kelvin right now. So we just had 15 minutes called. All right. You're about halfway there. Um, the mini's safely up. Do you want to see what that instrument looks like? We can mm -hmm. check yes. that out. Let's okay. check it out. Emily, can you kick on the overhead mini here? Let's shut the door. 
Perfect. Ooh, nice. I like it. Great. Oh. Okay, so that's, uh, we can come down in intensity, I think. Where are you right now? You're at 44. 44. Okay, okay. so that's 44 it's points on the overhead. 30. Okay. Great. Great. Uh, and so we still have that SL1 in that other room right okay. now to dial in. Uh, let's. Can we finish with the uh, with the inside here of that room with this yeah. because we added the, the oh, that's right. quad, the dash. Yeah. Yep, so yep, yep. same same color with this one. Okay. Same. Emily, what is this color on there? Just so people know, just. Is so it a number? This is a custom color that we pulled from the Dario Argento reference photo. That's, that right. That's right. And we saved it into Senda's library, so now we can send it to all the different fixtures. Very cool. Nice. So if you want to reference this at home, Google Dario Argento movies and pull this color using the color picker on the Mimex. We're getting flared a little bit. Would you like a matte box, you think? Oh, yes, so yes, we need a matte box. So we can see that this lens is flare. Okay. Flares a little mitigated there. Oh. So eyebrow up, eyebrow. Nice. We want contrast, yeah. Down, okay. All right. How's the intensity? Great. Right. Uh, the intensity is pretty good right now. So what right. what are we? Ten. Ten? Okay. Yeah, that's Perfect. pretty good. Lacey, what's our time? Twelve forty-five. Okay, so I think just the direction of this one, mm -hmm. maybe we can uh, try to have a little bit more here on the shoulder and a little bit more on the top. So if we can come up with the picture and come a little closer. Okay. And so while we're doing that, can we do a little puff of haze to see how it looks in the background? I want to change my mind. I think so here we're going to be blue and when he's going to open the door, it's going to be red. Can we do that? Oh, okay. Because like the danger's over there. Exactly. The okay, danger's over okay. there, not inside. Oh. We're in the, yeah. Yeah, because safe we're here. safe here. That's a great idea. Yeah. Okay. So, Emily, let's go to that blue color in here, and then this same red, though, that send a like, let's have that be inside that other room, please, on that SL1. Blocking the fixture so over. Hold this up more, then? A, a tiny bit more up. Mm -hmm. uh, it's more like uh, to have some light hitting it, you know? Mm -hmm. So, as you open the door, you do this, you know? Instead of, ha of keeping it here, you know, you do this. Yeah. All right, can I grab a stinger in this other room, please? Oh, can we have a stinger? How, five minutes left? Five minutes. Oof. Yeah, we need to bring back some more hay. So let's close that door a little bit. Thank you. So open it slowly, Sean. Stop. Okay, great. Cool. So now I think that's a little much. So uh, can we... Uh... Oh my god, that's very Dario Gento, though. Okay. Yeah, two more. 45, that's it. Okay, cool, so um, let's do a little bit more haze. We lost the uh, yep, atmosphere. Yep, 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 grab some haze. We're good with the haze, we're good, yeah. We're, okay. we're good with the haze. We're good yeah. with the haze. Oh, it's, it's turning, it takes a little while, okay. We're good with the haze! <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> Cool. Uh, so um, I think we're almost ready. So okay. we're gonna. 30 seconds left. 30 seconds. We're starting here. here. And then we're gonna push all the way through. Okay. Uh, so a little focus adjustation. Yep, 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 yep. Uh, adjust. And then. Uh, that was 30 minutes. Congratulations. You've already created something I think super cool.
Okay, that was very, very cool. Yeah. Um, can you walk us through the shots? Uh, did you achieve what you set out to do? I think we did, yeah. So we changed color because I felt like the danger was outside, so we wanted to feel safe and blue inside. I mean, that's what Dario Argento does. Like, mm -hmm. the good is in blue, and then the danger, evil, is in red. And uh, walk through some of the uh, technology that she used. So you you stayed on the Sigma 50 throughout. You had dashes in the ceiling, yeah. and and kind of what was each instrument doing really? So dashes for background, uh, SL1. Yeah, I had the dashes for the background, and then uh, SL1 as a backlight, and also to detach the uh, our character from the background uh, because it was wearing dark. And then after we had our uh, SL1 in the bathroom that was creating this red light where it was going and lighting up our uh, scissors. <laughs> and, um, and yeah, we used the 50 because I knew that I wanted to be a bit more further uh, at the beginning, have a wider and to feel the tension so we could have a tight shot of his face, you know, turning and then have a nice medium when he was going out through the door. So you also worked with the Roscoe team in the MyMix app. You took a uh, reference image from one of Dario Argento's movies to kind of catch a specific color, which is an interesting, interesting feature of the MyMix app. Mm -hmm. So can you talk a little bit about that? Yeah, so we wanted to go Dario Argento. So, you know, what's best to find his images, you know, on the internet. So when we grab that, we try to look for our uh, blue uh, and then our red. We could feel, can I say that maybe our red was not exactly the right red? It's, you know, sometimes when you have a photo, it's not exactly the right color. It was a little too uh, pink, so we went uh, more towards like a more orange and red direction. And we can, we can also tweak the saturation, but I think that's a great way to start from a reference and say, okay, here we go. We start from here, and then we saturate more, you know, more intense, blah, blah, blah. And then you, know, you find what you like at the end also. I mean, yeah, you, you, you said it yourself. It's a starting place and you're exactly. building from there. Mm -hmm. You get the perfect color. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, Senda, great. thank you so much. The thank results you. speak for themselves. That was so cool. <laughs> yeah, great. That was awesome. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to catch other episodes of this series and to follow Roscoe and Sigma on social media for all sorts of content exactly like this. And have a great day, everyone.